Good morning, everybody. It's Ramona, your independent Sensi consultant. Welcome back to Sensi Saturday. And today we're talking about the first two cents from the Sensepirations collection. And next week we'll follow up with the final two and get back into uh, picking uh, from the pile again. Um, there's just so much new in the fall. I'm not complaining because I love fall and winter scents. So bring it all on. I'm going to buy all of them, which I already did, and we'll melt and review all of them. So that's why we haven't been picking from the pile very often uh, for the last several, like, month or more. But anyhow, probably, well, since before I moved, probably. But anyhow, we're back at it today. So let's get started. So the first one we'll talk about is Christmas Cottage. And this was chosen by... Uh, CC Sense 2103. So thank you so much. Uh, scent notes go like this a cozy, inviting blend of Valencia oranges, raspberries, cloves, and spice. Now, I've had this in the past, and I've only bought it one time years ago, and I didn't care for it then, and so I've not repurchased it ever. Um, and it's been around a while. So when it came in this collection, I wasn't jazzed on getting it. It's like, oh, no, I know I don't like that one. So when I smelled it on cold, it's like, oh, no. Yep, I remember now. It smells like just red hot cinnamon candy. And I'm not a red hot cinnamon fan. I like bakery cinnamon, but not that really astringent, sharp, red hot cinnamon scent on cold. However... On warm, I take back every thought I bad thought I had about it in the past, and I really enjoyed it. When it's warmed, I do get a little bit of the oranges, and I get uh, some cloves. Um, so that red hot cinnamon note that was smelling on cold really, really settled down, and with the clove, it just turns into more of like a what I call a bakery cinnamon, something that's for my nose I can tolerate. So all in all, this was a really nice blend and I will purchase it again next year. I only have a, uh, four cubes left, so I will be finishing that this year. Will I get another one this year? Probably not, because I have so much, you know, winter, fall, winter scents now. Um, and I just placed an order the other day and I already have a stash, so I don't really need to be adding more. But if I was out of all my winter stash, I would repurchase this. This is a repurchase for me. So again, I take back all the bad thoughts and it is definitely a thumbs up for me. Um, and when Jason walked in, he doesn't like really bakery scents and I wasn't sure how this was going to go with him, but he said, Oh, what's in the warmer? He said, when he walked in the door from work and I, you know, said, Oh, it's called Christmas cottage. I really like that. It's like, Oh, okay, great. <laughs> Cause, um, I'm trying, I'm trying, you know, he, 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 the only thing he really, really does not care for that he has told me is, uh, almond croissant. So I don't melt that uh, in the evening or weekends when he's here. Uh, other than that, he's pretty easygoing, at, at least that he hasn't said that he doesn't, you know, dislike anything enough for me not to melt it. But anyhow, he liked this one is what I was getting at. So, scent appeal for me, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10 throw. Also very decent, 8 to 9 out of 10. It was really strong in the house. No problem smelling it at all. So definitely this is a thumbs up. And yes, it would be a repurchase. So that's a good one. The other one is Christmas Cottage Cider. Let me just refresh my nose. Okay. Uh, let's see. And this was chosen by uh, Candice Cantu. So thank you very much, Candice. Scent notes are brew some homey vibes with mulled spices, cinnamon stick, and perky Valencia orange. Now, you might say, well, that just is like uh, Christmas Cottage. And basically, there's oranges, there's cinnamon, or so, cloves, and spices. So... Um, the difference is, well, A, I didn't smell the raspberries in the Christmas cottage. The difference is the spices are a little more, um, along the tunes of gingerbread. It smells, this smells like gingerbread to me. Although you don't really get a bakery note, but this, the spices do. I get less Valencia orange in this one than I did in Christmas cottage. It was okay. Um, I thought I would like it more because I do like really most cider scents. Excuse me. Um, uh, but if this Valencia orange had come out a little bit more, 
I think I would have liked it. And it does say perky Valencia orange, but on cold, I don't smell a whole lot. And on warm, I didn't smell a whole lot. This one, I liked it, nothing wrong with it. it I wish it had more of the orange. So for scent appeal, I gave it a seven. And for throw, also very strong, eight, eight and a half, nine, in that zone where it was very good, very present. You could definitely smell it throughout the whole place. Um, so this one also is a thumbs up as well. So thank you ladies for both of those. Well, I'm not sure if CC is a lady, but thank you friends <coughs> for playing along. So next week, as I said, we'll be finishing off the uh, collection with Christmas Cottage Wreath and Christmas Cottage Mint. And this is, whoops, the cute box that it comes in. It's great for gift giving. Gift one to you and gift one to a friend. And it also comes with a scent circle as well. So um, that's really good little gift collection there. So I think that's it for now, everybody. I hope you are having a fantastic weekend and I will see you soon. Bye.